She did not feel very well. Her blood pressure did go down a little bit. We have to leave early, so on and so forth. The next, she wasn't feeling so well. She went to lay down, and you know, five minutes after that, yeah, going into an episode. And she did say that she'll do it within like 10 minutes, get all the photos that we need. One. Guys, today is a very, very special day. Janice and I are doing our maternity photo shoot. Yes, we are super excited. That's why we are dressed semi-decently. At least me, she's nice. Janice has gotten her hair done, did. She looks beautiful. She is not talking right now because Janice has had a rough morning, right, babe? She did not feel very well. Her blood pressure did go down a little bit. Heart rate was still good. SpO2 or oxygen in your blood is was still perfect. She did start losing a little bit of hearing, kind of like that bad episode that landed her in the hospital, but it was very short-lived, thankfully. She called me up. I ran up to her, checked her vitals. You know, she actually ended up throwing up a little bit. We are at the ready with throw-up bags in the night table for these exact scenarios. So. She is now feeling a little better. Vitals are good, blood pressure is good, everything is great. So we are gonna proceed to go to our photo shoot, keeping in mind that she may not be able to do it, we may have to leave early, so on and so forth. And thankfully, our photographer, she is super, super sweet. She is more than understanding, and she did say that she'll do it within like 10 minutes, get all the photos that we need, no big deal, and she's gonna work with us to make sure that we get it done, did, as quickly as humanly possible. So. That is where we're going right now. We're going to go to a little nearby place, take some beautiful photos. Guys, this is life with chronic illnesses. Janice woke up in the morning early, earlier than me. She got up, showering, getting her hair done, makeup done, did everything. She looks gorgeous. She got the war paint on. Unfortunately, these things can't happen. It's not something that we are expecting. One moment she was working and doing everything perfectly fine. The next she wasn't feeling so well, she went to lay down and you know, five minutes after that, yeah, going into an episode. So these are things that unfortunately do happen. And all you can do is prepare for them, make sure that you are ready with any kind of possible scenario, having to throw up, medication, hydration, whatever it may be. And that's what we try to do each and every single time. We do not enjoy having to cancel, reschedule plans, but we do. Um, fortunately today we didn't have to plus you know this photographer has already been bought and paid for and again she's super sweet helping us out making sure that we get it done quickly so Janice can come back home and rest so guys let us go do this alrighty guys so we are here on location we do have our masks the photographer is parked not too far away so we're gonna go meet up with her and start this photo shoot do it. photo shoot is going well and uh, we are now moving locations and yeah let's let's 
go do this, guys. It is so damn hot. It's not just the heat, it's the humidity. That right out right now outside it's 87, but it's probably like close to 90 plus percent humidity. It is really, really stupid hot out. We are excited. We are very happy with the quality of photos our photographer got. She showed us a couple of them like right then and there, and they look absolutely amazing. So we're excited. She said about a week or so for her to be able to edit all the photos, make sure everything looks good. And yeah, so we are super excited. We're happy that we finally got this done. And this is like the second time we, we rescheduled it for a little bit further along so Janice can show her little sushi bump. I feel like it's still very small. I don't look seven months pregnant. I haven't talked much in this vlog, but I did push through. We got great photos. The photographer was totally understanding of how I was feeling. And I bet she could tell from my demeanor I was just exhausted, like you guys could tell. Which I'm ready to take a nap and it's not even noon yet. Well, the first time we did photos with her at the photo studio place, you know, Janice was a lot more chipper. She was happy, jumping, playing, everything. And this time, she's just a little bit more like, for the photos, looks good. And then after that, okay. it's perfectly okay to be that way. It's not a big deal. But the most important thing is we got the photos done. Janice is okay. She's feeling decent. So now we are going to go home and rest. Hey, guys. So we are back home. It is late in the day now. It's nighttime pretty much. Yes, and we're tired. We have been resting and the rest really helped me. I slept for like four hours. Yep. And the baby Literally. needed it and it was perfectly fine. It was perfect. I got to watch my movies. So before we end this vlog, let us show you the finished results of our photo shoot. And you guys tell us how do you think the pictures turned out. I'm excited that I was able to muster up enough spoons for this maternity shoot. So guys, what did you think? How did that turn out? I think they turned out really great. I know I was the star of the shoot and Sushi was second. Maybe she was first, I was second, I was Janice was definitely third. I was gonna say, you still go first. God dang. Honestly, I'm happy, you know, I was able to get it done. In between the photos, I'm over here just dying of agony, not mm -hmm. really much in the mood, but 
I know in the future I'm gonna look back and be like I'm so happy I was able to do this and I pushed myself so guys this is where we end it this is where we're gonna take it easy and keep relaxing don't forget to like share and subscribe and also check out our other social media platforms such as Instagram and Patreon. We love doing Instagram so you guys can see the perspective of Orion, how Orion does things, how Orion feels about certain things, and this journey that he is taking with us as my service dog. Also, don't forget to check out Patreon because they get behind the scenes scoops on what is going on. They probably were the first ones to get a couple glimpse of our photo shoot first. So if you guys want to check that out, look in the links below in the description box. Also guys, check out our Amazon baby registry. If you guys still haven't seen it, check out our baby shower live. It is there saved on our channel. You could go back, see us opening up all our gifts and enjoying this journey with you guys. We're so happy you guys are taking this along with us. Anything that you guys continue to get us for Amazon, we greatly appreciate it. You Very have much. no idea. This journey can take a toll and I don't know what I would do without so much of your help, guys. You guys have no idea. It's a blessing. So this is where we end it. This is where we take it easy. And I hope you guys are having an amazing time as well. So guys, for now, adieu and good night.